thought we played very well for about 29 minutes. Uh, I thought our players came out very focused. Uh, they had great preparation for this game. And for 29 minutes, we executed the game plan perfectly, both offensively and defensively. We got the exact looks that we thought we could get offensively, especially out of the ball screens in the first half. Um, and then we were able to take a lot of things away from them defensively. We got some great doubles in the post um, and really made things tougher for them. I mean, this is a team that shoots the ball great, and we hold them to 35% shooting in the first half. I mean, that was great. Um, but then I thought, unfortunately, we started to wear down a little bit. We started to lose our focus. And they're just too good of a team that if you lose that focus for just a couple minutes, they're going to come right at you. And I thought that's exactly what happened. We were just like slow getting to like open um, areas in the paint and stuff, which just I feel like went downhill from there. Our pace and our attacking mentality uh, was fabulous until they went to the zone. And then I thought that that really put us off balance. We lost our pace offensively. Uh, we didn't move the ball quick enough. We didn't take advantage of the gaps in the zone that were there. And then unfortunately, I thought that carried over to our defensive pace. Uh, I don't think we were as good as transition. I didn't think we were getting up and playing things quite as well. It just kind of lulled us to sleep in a way. Um, and that's you know it's something we talked about in timeouts, but we just weren't able to adjust. Gabby is such a great player. And you can tell where she's missing in the game. But I feel like overall, the post players, we came together. You know, We had a new defensive plan. We doubled the post. And it worked the first half. And the second half, we kind of lost that focus and stuff. So yeah, we miss Gabby. But I mean, I feel like we picked up I feel like she would be proud of us, especially in the first half. I feel I feel like we have a, enough talent. I feel like the talent is there. Um, it's just the um, preparation, the practice, um, staying focused on the game plan that the coaches give us is what we need to do. Again, there's no moral victories here. Um, we, we're here to win, and we want to be the type of program that can beat teams that are in the top 12, top 10. And our team knows that, and they're, they're, they're disappointed. But I think at the same time, this also shows them the type of team that we're capable of being. Uh, we have a lot of talent. We did this without one of our best players who is away from our team right now. And that shows what we're capable of. And what I told the team is that we just need to start to mature, and we need to start to understand the team we're capable of being. There's, there's no time to wait anymore. There's no time to wait for experience. There's no time to wait to grow up. It's time to grow up. I feel like the one thing we definitely learned is um, confidence. Um, just knowing that from the first half, seeing how well we can play with the, um, a ranked team, I feel like that gave us a lot of confidence because I feel like our team is kind of like not certain since we lost three, three really good players. So I think this gave us a lot of confidence.